Hi there. Real quick before we jump into the episode. If you enjoy this episode or any of the other episodes, be sure to give us a follow or subscribe. It would also be great if you shared it with a friend or better yet, left a review so others can know how awesome it is. Thanks so much. And now, the episode. Hey there, Press Starters, and welcome to the Press Start Leadership Podcast, the podcast about game-changing leadership, teaching you how to get the most out of your product and development team and become the leader you were meant to be. Leadership coaching and training for the international game industry professional. Now, let me introduce you to your host, the man, the myth, the legend, Christopher Mifsud. Hey there, Press Starters, and welcome back to another awesome edition of the Press Start Leadership Podcast. On this week's episode, we're discussing balancing leadership and production in the video game industry, using the 80-20 rule for success, maximizing efficiency and productivity for successful video game development. In the fast-paced world of video game development, time is of the essence. Developing a successful video game requires a careful balance of leadership and production tasks. While production is critical to the actual creation of the game, effective leadership and management are essential to ensuring that the project stays on track and meets its goals. In this podcast, we'll explore the importance of leadership and production in the video game industry and discuss how the 80-20 rule can be applied to help teams balance their tasks effectively. The importance of leadership and management in the video game industry. Effective leadership and management are essential components of successful video game development. As with any complex project, video game development requires a clear set of goals and objectives, as well as a plan for managing resources and timelines to ensure that those goals are met. In the video game industry, leadership and management tasks can include setting goals and objectives, managing resources and budgets, providing guidance and feedback to team members, building and maintaining team culture, and overseeing the development process to ensure that it stays on track and meets the necessary quality standards. For example, a team leader in the video game industry may need to work closely with the game designer to ensure that the game's vision and goals are clear and well-defined. The leader may also need to work with the development team to ensure that they have the resources they need to complete their work and provide feedback and guidance to team members to help them improve their skills and work more effectively. Effective leadership and management can help teams overcome challenges and improve their output. For example, if a team is struggling with a particularly difficult aspect of the game development process, a good leader may be able to help them find creative solutions or provide additional resources to help them overcome the challenge. The role of production in the video game industry. While leadership and management are critical to the success of a video game project, production is the heart of the project. Production tasks involve actually creating and implementing game features, designing levels of environments, programming game mechanics, testing and debugging, and handling other technical aspects of game development. Production tasks require a combination of technical expertise, creativity, and attention to detail. For example, a video game artist may need to create intricate character models or detailed environments that match the game's aesthetic and meet the necessary technical requirements. A programmer may need to work on complex game mechanics that require a deep understanding of programming languages and algorithms. Ultimately, the quality and success of a video game project are dependent on the quality of the production work that goes into it. Without high quality production work, even the best leadership and management efforts will not be enough to ensure a successful game. Finding the right balance, the 80-20 rule in action. Given the importance of both leadership and production in the video game industry, finding the right balance between these tasks can be challenging. However, the 80-20 rule can be a useful framework for achieving this balance. The 80-20 rule, also known as the Pareto Principle, states that roughly 80% of the effects come from 20% of the causes. In the context of video game development, this means that 80% of the game's success may be determined by just 20% of its features or aspects. To apply the 80-20 rule to video game development, Teams can identify the critical 20% of tasks and features that will have the greatest impact on the game's success and then focus their efforts on those tasks. This may mean spending more time and resources on critical production tasks or prioritizing leadership and management efforts that are more likely to contribute to the game's success. For example, 
video game team may identify the critical game features that will have the greatest impact on players' experience, such as the game's story, user interface, or core mechanics. The team can then focus their efforts on refining and polishing those features to ensure that they are the highest quality possible. Similarly, the team leader in the video game industry may identify the critical leadership tasks that will have the greatest impact on the team's success. This may include setting clear goals and objectives, providing effective feedback, and guidance to a team member building and maintaining a positive team culture, and overseeing the development process to ensure that it stays on track and meets the necessary quality standards. By focusing on the critical 20% of tasks that will have the greatest impact on the game's success, teams can make the most efficient use of their time and resources, while still ensuring that both leadership and production tasks are given the attention they deserve. Potential pitfalls and considerations. While the 80-20 rule could be a useful framework for balancing leadership and production tasks in the video game industry, there are also potential pitfalls and considerations that teams should be aware of. One potential pitfall is overemphasizing production at the expense of effective leadership and management. While production is critical to the success of a video game project, effective leadership and management are also essential for ensuring that the project stays on track and meets its goals. Teams that focus too heavily on production may find themselves struggling to meet deadlines or experience other project management issues. Another potential pitfall is failing to adapt to changing circumstances and needs. The 80-20 rule could be a useful framework, but it's important for teams to be flexible and responsive to changing circumstances. For example, if a team encounters unexpected technical challenges, they may need to shift their focus more heavily towards production tasks to address those challenges. Finally, it's worth noting that the exact ratio of time spent on leadership and production tasks can vary depending on the specific circumstances and needs of the team or project. While the 80-20 rule can be a useful guideline, teams should be prepared to adjust their approach as necessary to ensure that they are achieving the best possible balance between leadership and production. Final thoughts. Balancing leadership and production tasks is essential for success in the video games industry. While production is critical to the actual creation of the game, effective leadership and management are essential to ensuring that the project stays on track and meets its goals. The 80-20 rule can be a useful framework for achieving this balance by helping teams to identify the critical 20% of tasks or features that will have the greatest impact on the game's success, and then focusing their efforts on those tasks. However, teams should also be aware of potential pitfalls and considerations, and be prepared to adjust their approach as necessary to achieve the best possible balance between leadership and production. By balancing leadership and production effectively, video game teams can increase their chances of developing successful games that captivate players and achieve critical and commercial success. Additionally, it's important to note that finding the right balance between leadership and production tasks is not just about maximizing productivity and efficiency, but also about creating a positive work environment and culture for the team. Effective leadership and management can play a critical role in building a positive team culture, fostering collaboration and communication, and helping team members feel valued and supported. This, in turn, can help to boost morale, increase job satisfaction, and improve overall productivity and output. Similarly, effective production work can help team members feel a sense of pride and accomplishment in their work, and can contribute to a positive team culture by demonstrating the team's creative and technical skill. Ultimately, the key to find the right balance between leadership and production in the video game industry is to approach these tasks holistically as two critical components of a larger whole. By doing so, teams can create an environment where both leadership and production are given the attention and resources they deserve, and where team members feel empowered and supported to do their best work. In conclusion, the video game industry is a complex and challenging field where success requires a careful balance between leadership and production tasks. By applying the 80-20 rule, focusing on the critical 20% of tasks that will have the greatest impact on the game's success, teams can achieve this balance more effectively and efficiently. However, it is important for teams to be flexible and responsive to changing circumstances, and to approach leadership and production tasks as critical components of a larger whole. By doing so, video game teams can create a positive and supportive work environment that fosters creativity, collaboration, and innovation, and ultimately produce successful and engaging games that captivate players and drive industry growth. All right, that's this week's episode of the Press Start Leadership Podcast. Thanks for listening, and most of all, thanks for being awesome. Hi there. The episode's over, but thanks for sticking around till the end. 
If you're on the quest to elevate your team's leadership, production, or game design capabilities, I'm here to assist. Leveraging extensive experience and a strategic approach, I offer personalized audits, bespoke workshops, and leadership retreat facilitation to drive your team toward excellence. My commitment is to provide efficient, reliable, and proven support, ensuring you have the tools and insights needed to thrive. Ready to unlock your team's full potential and achieve unparalleled success? Don't hesitate to press start on your journey to transformation today. Feel free to reach out directly to discuss how we can tailor a solution to meet your unique needs and goals. Let's connect and take your team's performance to the next level.